previously on The Next Step. Max is a really good dancer, and it's nice to have on our team. One. Hey, guys. Oh, thanks. That was really fast. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm pretty fast, you know. I'm, I'm fast. Yeah, I pride myself on that, but no worries. That's right. Speed is one of my best qualities. I can't believe it. La Ballet de Lorraine offered me a touring company position. I'm gonna make my dream come true. And five, six, seven, eight, hit one. <gasps> okay, clearly <laughs> we need to work on that end pose. But don't worry about it, you guys worked super hard, so let's call that a wrap on the group rehearsal. You can head home. Okay. Thank you. I'm walking into the studio, and I'm a little nervous about how the team's gonna react to my decision. Hey, oh. Chloe. Where were you? I think you need to tell him. I've been offered a position under La Belle de Lorraine for the Nutcracker Touring Company. Seriously? Oh my gosh. What? Oh, it's incredible. That's awesome. So, how are you going to internationals and doing the production at the same time? Well, I can't. I've chosen the Nutcracker. Is that okay? Oh, that's too bad. But we're so happy for you, <laughs> Chloe. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I couldn't be more proud. This is her dream, and I'm just very, very happy that she's following her dream. This calls for a celebration. Drinks are on Chloe. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's yeah. go. Six, seven, eight, and good. Nice. Okay, pause, pause, pause. Internationals is being very vague with each dance round, so we're working on a trio to be prepared. Let's just keep running it, okay, yeah. from the yeah. top again. Well, actually, Miss Kate, I have to go. What do you mean you have to go? I have to help my mom set up for our barbecue this weekend. Do you have to leave now, though? Yeah, we really need to rehearse, Amanda. It's kind of frustrating that Amanda has to leave because our dance is nowhere near where we need it to be. Well, trust me, guys, I don't want to do this now, but I have to. Sorry. Okay. I feel really bad because Giselle and Talia want to stay and keep rehearsing it. Hopefully, they'll be fine without me. Okay, we can just work with the two of you. We'll figure out your spacing. Um, can I go get some water? Sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, take five, and then we'll come right back. Okay, cool. What are you doing? Oh, uh, I'm just waiting for James. It's our anniversary. Oh! Yeah. Did you get him anything? Um. No, I mean, I feel like us just being together is more important than a present, so. I thought that we should spend time with each other just because that's kind of like a gift in itself. <laughs> Bye, lovebird. Bye. Hey. You okay? Happy anniversary. Oh. <laughs> I may have forgotten about my anniversary a little bit, so I had to sprint to Aunt Kathy's house to grab some chocolates. I hope she likes them. Chocolates. Yeah. Um, why are why are half of them eaten? I decided to eat the ones that I know you don't like. Okay. And specifically that one, because I thought you might be allergic to it, because it's full of allergies. But this is like an appetizer gift, okay? It's like a warm-up. I got you an even bigger, better present for later on today. I have nothing. Yeah, well, pff, I got you something, too. <laughs> what? You know, and it, it, it involves things. Things? Lots. Oh. Things. I've got nothing. Best anniversary ever! Okay. I'm so excited! Okay. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Chloe. I need you guys help. I forgot about my anniversary with Riley. You forgot? What are you gonna do, bro? I got her a box of chocolates. Okay, that's good, that's good. Yeah. 
half-eaten box oh, of chocolates. That's, that's horrible. But that's why I use my famous bait-and-switch technique and promise her an even bigger gift later. But I don't know what that is, <laughs> man. Right. You have to help me. Well, you know what? It's good you came to us, buddy. I am great with gift-giving ideas. I mean, I'm just the idea guy. Why don't you take on a trip around the world? Yeah, yeah. You know, that's it. That's it. That's, it. that's the one. No, that's, the one. that's idiotic. OK. Um, I got the perp I got the perfect, perfect okay. one. OK, what about a baby pig? Oh, that's a baby so cute. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, so 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 no. <laughs> no. West, you're an idiot. Do you have any ideas? No. <laughs> hey, thanks, guys. I don't even know why I asked you guys. Did you? Did you? I have never seen anybody catch a glass of milk falling off of a table without anything spilling. Of course. What did you just do? Um, I don't know. No, no. You just caught that glass without spilling any contents onto the floor. It's nothing, really. I don't know why they're freaking out. I just caught a glass of milk. <laughs> Can't anyone do that? All right. Noah, you're a freak. We're gonna have to check this out. We? Yeah. 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 Time for some investigating. I have never seen anyone like Noah before. We gotta see what else he can do. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Four. Internationals can throw anything at us, so we need to be prepared and perfect as many routines as possible. And then I think we go down on eight? Yeah, or eight and. Talia and I are working on our trio. Amanda's supposed to be here, but she had to leave to go to a family barbecue. We really can't afford to wait for Amanda right now, so hopefully she'll catch up later. Maybe we could add a little bit of a floor section. One of those. Ooh, I really like that. That's really nice. Yeah, yeah I think that would be perfect. That looks solid. Thank you. I mean, it's hard when you're doing a trio with two people, so. Actually, Max, if you wouldn't mind standing in for Amanda, we would really appreciate that. Would that would really help us with spacing. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. I'll help. Max coming to help us is the perfect fix. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Max is picking up the choreography so fast. I think that works. I think that'll work there. I think you guys are limiting yourself with the acro. You could do more. It's just that Amanda, Amanda really can't do much in acro. You don't all have to do it. It's true. You know what? We can just try it for now and see how it goes. Seven, eight. I think that's perfect. I think it's gonna look really cool. I mean, I knew he was good, but he's really good. Now I'm going to Levi and Shane because they are my last hope for a gift idea. What do you got so far? Man, I gave her a half-eaten box of chocolates because it's all I can find. <laughs> Not good. <laughs> I know. I feel like you should make her something. Like, DIY. Do it yourself. Uh, OK, uh, well, I was going to get her a card. What, should I make her a card? Why not? I'm good at drawing. I'm good at cutting things out. I can paste. Oh, man, that's worse than the baby pig, man. <sighs> Making a card is a terrible idea, but that gives me another idea. Can you guys help me with something? Sure. I know exactly what to get Riley. Alan, Sierra, and I have collected a whole bunch of items from Hidalgo's to see how good Noah really is. One, two, three. Oh. Unbelievable. This kid is insane. We need to make this more challenging. Noah, turn around. Wes, Sierra, and Eldon think they're testing me, but really, they're not. I could catch this stuff anytime. All right, Noah, catch this. How did he actually? How does he do it? 
I don't understand. I can't believe this game. We're gonna have to take this to another level. How much for one of these? A mug is a perfectly good gift, right? I mean, he gave me a half-eaten box of chocolates. <sighs> You're one lucky girl, Riley. What? You have no idea how great a gift James has for you. Could you give me a hint? Comes from the heart. I'll catch you later. Heartfelt. Why didn't I think of that? I need to up my game. Well, hey! Right now, we're showing Miss Kate our trio because we want her to see all the changes that we made. We're floating through the darkness endlessly. We're meant to I feel really great about this trio. I'm, I really did not expect Max to fill in like he has. We're adding elements that we would have never added if Amanda was in the trio. Max is dancing in my position. I can't do what Max is doing. I can't do half the tricks in that dance. Acro's not my strong style. <laughs> yes, you guys. I love that. Oh my goodness, those acro tricks make such a difference. The trio is awesome. Giselle, Talia, and Max took an ordinary routine and turned it into something amazing. That is the bar that we need to reach if we want to win internationals. So does anyone want to tell me what's going on and why the dance is completely different than what it was yesterday? Amanda, I have decided to have Max replace you in the trio for internationals. Look, if you can pick up the choreography, I would be happy to put you back in. Obviously, I'm not going to learn these acro moves overnight. I mean, I wish I could, but if they want acro in the dance, Max is better for it than I am. You know what? Max can have it. I really feel guilty about replacing Amanda with Max, but at the same time, we're at internationals here and we all want to do the best. So I hope she just understands that. All right. We had to find a new way to test Noah's abilities. He can catch anything, so let's see if he can dodge things, too. Oh. I did this when I was three years old. Come on, guys. Give me a little bit of a challenge. Not only can he dodge balls, he can do it while flipping. Ready for this one? This is getting ridiculous. But I think I know how to beat Noah. If this next test doesn't work, I don't know what will. I'm waiting for Riley, and I'm really excited, because I cannot wait to give Riley my gift. Yo, when she comes in, don't say anything. OK, OK. Um, why did you text me to come here? Honestly, while writing this song, it actually came pretty easy to me because I just reflected on how I felt about her. We took a ride on a Monday And that's when I fell, I fell in love with you Your big brown eyes, I can't stop staring I wrote about how much I love our relationship and what I love about her. And I really hope that that comes out in the song. You've been a gay, like a cat
song that James wrote for me, I mean, it's so sweet and really cute and quirky, and I love it. We had our ups and downs, but we always seem to make it through the day. You always bring me round. We're gonna make it. Did you love it? Yes, of course I did. Happy anniversary. <laughs> Happy anniversary. <laughs> this gift is perfect. And I still have nothing for James. So yeah, I, I'm more than a little worried. Marco. Polo. 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 We had to take things to a whole nother level. Marco. Polo. Now we're gonna test his senses in the dark. Marco. Polo, we've got night vision goggles on and he's blindfolded. If he can find us in this, I don't know what this kid can do. What's going on, Elvin? Of course Noah finds me first. What's going on, Sierra? Wow. What? We cannot defeat Noah. Why are you doing some like jellyfish dancing right now? I can sense all of them, and honestly, it's really easy. Man, Noah, you're so sick, man. <clears throat> Noah. You hit me in the throat, bro. Come on, enough bro, with the I'm, shoe. I'm sorry, I, I thought. You know what? I'm gonna go find a building, to throw Noah off of, and you too, Wes. Noah's aced every single test that we've given him. It's like we haven't even scratched the surface of his abilities. The next step has their very own superhero. I'm sorry about what happened. I know. It's just the studio's all about acro now, and I don't do acro. I can't believe Giselle and Tally would give away my spot without asking me about it. I thought they were my friends. I thought they were my closest friends on this team. It's not your fault, so don't worry about it. I could teach you acro. Well, think about it. Last year, I thought I was one of the best, and this year, I think I'm one of the worst. I don't know where I stand anymore at the studio. Well, I couldn't find the jasmine. I desperately need a gift for James, and I thought that Aunt Kathy could help. So, Riley, how can I help you today? Um, I need a gift for James for our anniversary. Oh, will you come to the right person? I'm the expert. Oh, on, on presents? No, on James. Everybody loves him. Oh. <laughs> Great. Look at that painting. He did that. Oh, really? Uh, how old was he? 16. 16? Mm. Oh. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I love how the boat doesn't touch the water. Oh, he's always loved painting. <laughs> Oh, I, uh, Riley, are you hungry? I, I'm sorry, normally I would have some chocolates to offer you, but I don't know where they've gone. They seem to have disappeared since this morning. <laughs> oh, uh, were they about yay big, half eaten? Mm. The whole painting theme for our Nationals duet was James's idea. And after I saw the painting in Aunt Kathy's house, I know exactly what to get James for anniversary. What? What is this? Are you ready for your gift? My gift? I'm super confused right now because I walk into Studio A and there's this canvas on the ground and <laughs> Riley looks like a scientist. Put that on. 
Okay. Our Nationals duet was James's idea, and it was so much fun dancing in a painting with him. So I thought, why not dance in a painting for real? Okay, so what? Are we gonna like paint a picture or something? Yeah, we're gonna make a human painting. It's my anniversary oh. gift to you. Come on. Okay, it's yeah. on. This gift is actually kind of perfect. It's really cool that she found a way to combine painting and dance. It's like she knew I would love this. It is also lots of fun to get to throw paint at each other and roll around in the ground. <laughs> Being with Riley has been the best time of my life. And this anniversary feels like the old us. We're just connected again. It's the best anniversary ever. No matter how hard it has been, it has also been the most fun I've ever had with anyone. So I couldn't thank him enough for that.